Alright, now I have a small challenge for you. So, what we're going to do is build a landmass for this thing, and I use a box. Okay, I go like that, and I make the box really thin, and really big, and really thin. And then I'm going to take the top face and the bottom face and hit extrude. Okay. Then I'm going to go back to object and go mesh smooth. This is a way to make kind of a ground plane that technically has no beginning and start. In other words, when I'm wa I'm up here looking at this building as a presentation piece, really the background kind of blends in. But if it was a square, let's see if I can get back to the, see how it dead ends. That doesn't look quite nice. So edit, redo poly smooth. Okay, the challenge is simple. Um, so you're going to make one of these. And then what you're going to do is put an asphalt texture on this that matches the resolution of everything else in the scene. In other words, I do not want to be able to distinguish that you were not taught asphalt because asphalt's just kind of like cement. So if you need help with the texture, you know, just go back where I made the cement and it's the very same way. The trick here is you're going to have to put the UVs down on this thing. Okay? And I want to see what you do, how you do it. So think of this as like a mini quiz or whatever. Um, that's that's what you're going to have to do. Now, this doesn't end the actual unit. The unit ends after the discussion board. After the discussion board, you're going to have lights in here, and you're going to have a rendered scene. For the IP, however, once you get done with it, I'm going to need a copy of the project. Okay, so all the textures, all the material, all the geometry in a Maya scene zipped up so it opens on my computer. So, get the asphalt done, and when you're done, uh, we'll start on the discussion board, and we'll look at lighting in the next video.